Welcome, Grizzlies, to the December edition of the KZZK Blind Peak Beers of the Month. Thirsty people, we've got something for you for, uh, you know, the garland and the uh, tree and the, all your guests uh, around the house. Plus, well, you need to bring them here because this is mm. the place you can get it. Something that I haven't had before. Sean, have you yeah. had this before? No, we didn't put the tree up in the background. We yeah. were going to, but we didn't get that done. I have not. Uh, we're going out to Boulder for the first one. Back to Boulder for the flashback India Brown Ale. Now, this is, you don't know, usually IPAs with pale ales, mm -hmm. something like that. this is an India Brown Ale, and there are some similarities to it, but it does uh, stand on its own. Yeah, you mentioned the, the similarities. You start there. The India, it usually denotes something that's been overly hopped or, or overtly hopped, I guess I should say. That was to keep the beer fresh on the long road to the British provinces out when they had the colonies and that kind of thing. So they really developed that. And then ale, so we're still talking about the same style of beer, but Jeremy, the B makes the big difference from pale to brown exactly. in this boulder. Yeah, it's. Uh, I mean, I think it's a different malt that they use to make it, you know, more of a brown ale. And, uh, you know, like you said, we're, we're going back to Boulder for this one. Um, we've done a couple of Boulder beers already. Um, this flashback one, it was actually, for, it was made for their 30th anniversary, which was, I believe, in 2009. Um, and so they brewed this as a specialty. It was a special release for the, for the anniversary, something they had never tried before. And they liked it so much, it's now actually sold year-round by Boulder. So uh, it... To the experiment well. that turned out yeah, well. Exactly. Good call on their part. Mm -hmm. What's the uh, the uh, alcohol content on this? Six point eight. So th this will Have serve some you fun. well. <laughs> <laughs> Stay warm. <laughs> The holidays get real friendly if you come down to the uh, Blind Pig and have the Flashback India Brown Ale, one of the beers of the month for December. It starts out a little smooth the, at the front. It You you will. You'll very much and just it say, this is very... it doesn't really bite you until the back end. Right. Yeah. You, you will say, this, this is a, a very close cousin. It's mm -hmm. it's akin to an IPA, mm -hmm. but it's just not quite. And it does stand up and, and snap at you, but it's not in an angry way. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. It's yeah, smooth at the beginning, and you get more of the uh, the snap that you would think of with an IPA in this IBA at the back end. So it'll stand up to a lot of different things. I'm going to pair it up with some of your richer holiday foods. It's going to stand up and be right there for you. Come in and say, I need an IBA, flashback IBA from Boulder Brewing. Four dollars. At the pig. Sorry, at, call me on the pig. Four dollars a pint. Have another <laughs> drink. <laughs> the IBA for Boulder. The other beer we've got uh, for December on the uh, KZZK Blind Pick Beers of the Month actually smells like maybe it just got freshly brewed for your morning commutes. Our uh, friends at Schlafly's have put together a coffee stout, gentlemen. What is going on? This is uh, some high octane uh, beverage going on here. It's not. This too smells strange. like it's a, a combination of uh, something you have after work and something you have to get up in the morning. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend doing this on your morning commute, but. You know, technically it's December, it's winter time, I know the uh, weather outside, it doesn't seem like it, but decided to go ahead with a, with a nice dark stout for, for the winter months, and uh, yep, the Schlafly coffee stout's the one we decided for, the, for this month. We've had the Schlafly's on many times before, mm -hmm. based out of St. Louis, and in this case, they've taken another St. Louis product, the Caldi's Coffee, that's pretty famous, and they've used it to brew, and that's how they get the coffee stout. So it's a stout, and they've infused it with the coffee, and it gives you some of that uh, those coffee notes you have a little bit more chocolate there you've got and I'm not a regular coffee drinker but you've got a little bit more uh, bitter to go along with it and it gives you almost a, a, that rush when you drink it I'll be honest with you the only thing missing from this is a little bit of ice and a little bit of cream this would yeah. be like an iced, iced coffee, coffee. Mm -hmm. it really would be and it I, I'm gonna say boo to the Schlafly's people right now and I'm talking to you Schlafly's people if you're gonna be true Schlafly's of St. Louis the coffee you should use here should be Dana Brown the safari <laughs> roast, and you, you know I'm right. Do that. You could definitely do that, but I see why they've gone and with the. You know I'm right, St. Louis, for this one here too. Jeremy, got 5.7 percent alcohol it's on this there, one, yeah, and bad. for stouts, it's really not that bad. Right? Yeah, it's pretty tame for a stout. But yeah, actually, the the story of why they started making it is the you know they they used to come over the people who worked at the coffee factory used to come over to the Schlafly Bottle Works after work. And they would order a stout, but then they'd also order a shot of espresso, and they'd just pour it in their beer. So finally, the people at Schlafly were like, well, they got to be doing something right. So they got together, they, they brewed it, and, and it works quite well. It's I, a bit, you got your chocolate in my peanut butter situation. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we have this today. It's there the Schlafly's go. coffee stout. Mm -hmm. Certainly worth a try, and you'll probably have many, many more 
Schlafly's. What, what's the specific uh, coffee that's in here? Caldi's. It's the, another St. Louis brand. Caldi's Coffee. The Schlafly's Coffee Stout. Come and try it. One of the other December beers of the month at the Blind Pig. Four dollars. Four bucks to find, as usual. Four bucks, you will Delicious. love it. Whether it's for breakfast or you're ending the day with it, I'm telling you. you After have, dinner. You have right to here. try it. Yeah. Yep. Here you go. The uh, coffee stout. Enjoy. It's the brown algae. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why our water tastes like shit all of a sudden. Brown algae. <laughs> You thought IBA stood for something else. <laughs> brown algae. <laughs> the brown, brown algae. algae. <laughs>